Today, a group of like-minded people and businesses in partnership with a like-minded government and some key like-minded stakeholders come together with a single purpose of shifting a very imbalanced load. That imbalance is hurting all involved in our industry in a great many ways and there is simply no valid reason for it being so. This morning we're going to put into place the latest piece of a six element program designed to do one thing, get more females to join and remain in this amazing New South Wales civil construction industry. Now, it's such an easy goal to say, and the name we have given these six elements seems so normal, the CCF New South Wales Women in Civil Program, but the issue, the problem, uh, the need for change in this industry is significant. What's absolutely clear is that we have to create an environment that women will want to be a part of. We have to focus on an environment that will welcome them, that will support them and that will treat them with respect. How? Well, our language and our imaging must align with that intent. We must provide data to debunk the myths about ability. We've got to explain to the world how good this industry is and how exciting and opportunity rich it is. And we've got to have success stories from both within employers and within employees to be able to communicate that to the world. We must have champions. We must talk about them because champions shatter stereotypes and they are absolutely impossible to argue against. Champions like CCF's own Kayleen Bosman. She's been in the industry, she's standing over there, she's been in the industry for 10 years, she's a very skilled plan operator, she just happens to have two young children. We also need to be on the front foot. We need to present our case to young women and their parents and we need to show how good our industry is. And for that, we must speak the language of our audience and we must speak through their communication channels. We've created a new website, a new Facebook, a whole new range of social media streams which are about communicating with these people. And we aren't doing it just from the safety of our offices. We're going out to our target audience. We've embarked with the support of the New South Wales Government, thank you, on a two-year program to go out to schools in New South Wales, across all of New South Wales, to talk about how wonderful this industry is. Kayleen's our champion. She's out in the field and I've set a KPI for all of the collateral that goes out, all the material, all the messaging, that it be equally balanced between male and females. And we need to take strong action to create an environment that someone looking in shows that there is support and respect for women, for such a place that is supportive and respectful will be seen as welcoming and a potential career home for their children and for themselves. So to do that, we needed a list of employers who have publicly demonstrated a commitment to support women in their businesses. These employers will lead the way and draw others with them. We needed these champions so we can say, look at this list. They, they are already doing it. They want to contribute to make this a better industry. For them, good business isn't just about taking, it's about giving. The CCF New South Wales family of members are indeed a very special bunch. So when we launched this sixth element and I rang the businesses in this room to ask them if they wanted to participate, my problem wasn't convincing them to do it, it was getting them off the phone. They were excited, they were eager, they all had stories 
that they wanted to tell. They got it. They absolutely got it. You get it. We can succeed at moving this heavy gender diversity imbalance, but as I said, we just simply can't do it alone. Ladies and gentlemen... Ah.